What's going on, adventurers? Tonight, we are at Brushy Mountain Prison. We got Patty from the G Team here. We got Clay, who is behind the camera right now. Thank you, Clay. And we got Kelsey from Kelsey's Paranormal and her husband, Josh. Patty just saw something over there. Yes, I so, uh, we might be a little bit crazy, but we're ready to head in there and see what's going on. All right, guys, so this is Brushy Mountain Prison. It was a maximum security prison, and back in the day, it was one of three, including Alcatraz and Leavenworth. Little person, Jack Jett, he was uh, murdered right here um, while on the phone to his mother. So right he here? was, yeah, we never had women here, but we think Bonnie was out of our family. Our family owned this when it went in lease to the state. And we think Bonnie was here long before the prison was here. So, um, mm -hmm. and she's one of our mo more active now. She likes music and um, she will dance if you've got dowsing rods and you're playing music. She'll dance to the beat of the music. Um, she loves to interact. She's a really fun one to interact with. What kind um, of music? Okay. Well, we're still trying to figure yeah. that out. We're, it used to be oldies. It was she was pretty tight on that, um, and then uh, but now dance. we really got her going on some Aussie. I'm yeah. telling you, <laughs> crazy train. Uh, I'm crazy telling train. you. So she's getting a little loose on that, but and she goes with the beat of the music. And sometimes your thousand rods will even bob up and down. She'll get oh, so wow. excited. She loves, loves, loves music. And when she doesn't like the song, she'll go like. She knows I usually play the music, so she, they'll turn to me and be like, come on now, wow. pick something else. And That is crazy. Yeah, yeah. she will. She, she'll, um, now, well, I had a woman out here one time. Now, you got to think when she would have been here, you know, around 1850s, what we're thinking. Um, and this woman that came in, she goes, you, you got to think where you're at, back here in the mountains, 1850. The woman says, Bonnie, are you black? She was dancing. The woman goes, Bonnie, are you black? And they stop. And they point at her. And they were like, they just sat wow. on her. And I was like, you've made her mad. You get to thinking about it. Because we do have one wow. out here that we interact with. And he is, a, a, we think, a black man. And when he c starts coming through, the dowsing rods will split and go to both sides of you. Oh, wow. And she'll, so we, that tells us she's who went behind us. And we always thought Henry was being mean to her. But come to find, I, th I got thinking about that, and I thought she was probably never around colored people of oh, any kind, right. of any kind. Mm -hmm. Bonnie, are you here tonight? Oh. Bonnie, well, she's all right. she heard. <laughs> that is awesome. I'm gonna hear some music, Bonnie. It's trying to recognize a face right Okay. She'll point at her, you know, until she gets her music going. She likes her music. All right, you ready, Bonnie? Ooh. What? She is dancing. Oh my God. That is insane. That is awesome. So if she doesn't like the song, she will not dance. Him. Ozzy. Oh, no, oh, she's telling her no. Oh, she's digging that one. <laughs> wow. That's amazing. That's crazy. <laughs> I've never seen anything like that. Me either. Now she'll get it. She'll go with the beat on this one. That's insane. I've never seen anything like that. Me either. It. So freaking cool. That is so crazy. <laughs> <laughs> Unreal. Ready to step it up, girl? Yes. <laughs> what? what the down. heck? <laughs> <laughs> Get down, girl. Yeah. That is the craziest thing I've ever seen. Wow. Okay, music is I know that's your favorite. You uh, yeah. <laughs> you wish you had a man to dance with, Bonnie? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Oh my God. Did you see the two men that are here tonight? We'll get one of them to dance with you later. Oh. 
Come on. There you go. Oh. Oh, Oh, my gosh. So we went to Footloose instead of Crazy Train. Wow. Okay, so now I know to remove half of those off the playlist. I love her. Bonnie, I appreciate you. Thank you, Bonnie. Thank you, Bonnie. So that is awesome. Now, if you want to bring your dowsing rods out, she'll she usually. Bonnie, okay. show us where you're standing at. Where are yeah, you at? Point to it. Where are you standing? She went behind me. Is that where you. Yeah. Look. Are you still behind me? Bonnie, where are you at? Show us where you're at. Oh. Yep. Oh, wow. <laughs> wow. That's pretty <laughs> That is crazy. crazy. What? Did they actually have death row here, Patty? Yeah, they did. They yeah, did? This was death row right in here, I think. This is where they, they held them. Hello there, is there any spirits for us? Like to communicate with us? That'd be great. I do not want to be in the back. Parents on there. Me too. Anything you'd like to say? Parents on there. Hello there. Come to talk. This is really scary looking. That's uh, where they would beat them. I don't know, it's very ominous here. You have four women in here right now. How's that make you feel? My batteries are getting drained really quickly, guys. Are they? Yeah. What was your life like here? Did you like to talk about it? Can't imagine what it was like being stuck here in this tiny cell. Living in fear of your life every day it had to have been rough. Especially for the ones that didn't really deserve to live that way. I know that some of them probably did, you know, for their crimes, but unfortunately some of them probably had very minimal crimes and was treated just as bad. Yeah. It's like sad. It's very sad. Yeah. It breaks your heart. Do you want to do a spirit box session in here? Yeah. Anybody here want to communicate with us? Who just pushed on Kelsey's bag? Don't do that. That's not cool. You're invading someone's personal space. Yeah, I don't want you to touch me. You can talk with me all day long. Please do not touch me. We want to hear what you have to say, but you're not allowed to physically touch any of us. How many spirits were here? Were you innocent or guilty? It just got really cold in here. Yeah, it did. Feel that cold? It got really cold. Oh. What's your name? Wow. You're making it very cold in here. Oh, I heard something. I feel it's very cold in here. Is that you? We're sorry for what happened to you if you didn't commit the crime. And even if you did, you didn't deserve to be beaten to death if that's what happened to you. It just like dropped like 20 degrees. It did, it's freezing in here. Oh. All right, what is your name? We know you're here with us. Whoa! Are you a man or a woman? Because you sounded like a female. Sometimes they can come out as female yeah. voices, but they are male. It's uh, just a, it's a weird thing, but that's just how they do. 
But could be Bonnie. Was that her name? Oh, it did sound like Bonnie. Yeah. Bonnie, is that you? The it is. We enjoyed watching your dancing. Is it safe here for us? Do you like it here? <laughs> you want to stay here? All right, so we're gonna continue walking around a little bit. Thank you so much for talking to us. Come on. Okay. Come on. Okay. This is the walk where James R. Ray was last kept. Cell 28 was his. Um, Zoo Man was 27. Tracker was the last 29. And um, the inmates that was kept here, I'll ask if we've caught the period dress cold miner. We have not. But a lot of the people that come in here with cameras that set up and try have got some really cool stuff off this walk. Um, okay. So, um, and another thing that happened down here, we had one here that he was kind of, he just wasn't right in the head, and and the inmates pulled a prank on him one day, told him that if he would jump from the walk over to our windows, they they kind of pop out that he could slide out the window and make an escape and he tried but all he done was fell to his death. You know, so oh my God. that happened wow. at the end of this walk. It's terrible. No, no, it really is. Um, now we have I don't believe that James already did the crime, but we have played Martin Luther King's speech down here. We have been hushed and told to be quiet and no and you get responses out of it. Okay. Um, so, but now I will tell you, the King family came here and they started the process of getting um, him a, a trial. They didn't believe he did it. So this is, this was James Earl Ray's yes. cell. The last time I was here, sitting in here, and this whole seat started vibrating. Why did you kill Martin Luther King? James Earl Ray, are you still here with us? Are you the one who vibrated the bed last time Patty was here? Why did you do that? We're here to listen to any messages that you may have. Is there anything you want to say? Are you are you innocent of a crime? We're really sorry that you were convicted un unfairly, and we were told that you actually were about to stand trial and you were murdered. So we're very sorry about that. Thank you so much for talking with us. Yeah, guys, this door was actually moving. Kelsey was just finishing up her alone challenge with her spirit box and as she was finishing up thanking James Earl Ray for speaking with her this door was very slowly opening it was really crazy this door is so freaking heavy guys like it's really hard to move it that slowly you have to put a lot of force behind you know when you're pulling it so for it to move that slowly that was very it was opening Yes. Opening. There was a purpose behind that. Like he yes. was trying to show us he was here. Yes, he was. I seen it too. Uh, we were just visiting with James Earl Ray, and we just kept hearing the footsteps here, and I, I felt like I saw something for a second. Is it up here? I don't think it's up. Do you want to go warm up first, real quick? Or? We had over a quarter of a million men that came here, wow. so it's over ten thousand. If you as did a rough, you know, guess that it would have been one a week mm. in the time that it was open. Wow. Yeah. Wow. Least, yeah. Because there was a lot, like, there's still 17 still in the coal mine out here. They had a crematorium here. You, you know, they, if you're burning bodies, you've got a lot of dead. You know what I mean? So. That's uh, true. 
Yeah. Uh, I know you're so thinking about this prison. This prison is different. It's going to be different than your Moundsville, your Mansfield. You need to prison you go to. This wasn't just a prison lot. Nashville would have been our Moundsville or our Mansfield. This was a work prison. They brought in and used these men as slaves. You would believe the money this generated for this state. I'm going to do something. All right, guys, thank you so much for joining us this evening on this spooky adventure. And we'll see you on our next Raptor Adventure.